Hello everyone, it's Nady, and today I'm gonna try to follow along a Trixie Mattel tutorial. As you be beautiful people know, any tip you may have, please cast it away, because this is a channel of positive energy, okay? Thank you. So I was thinking of all the big beauty YouTubers that I could try to copy a tutorial from, but it seems like a lot of people are picking the same beauty guru, so I thought who is somebody that I really, really love artistically and personality-wise, and that is Trixie. And I just have to say that though I am a sassy-ass bitch, I have yet to translate that into drag. I am not a drag queen, so I'm really not certain what to expect today. And I also want to note that I probably don't have a majority of what Trixie is using. I'm assuming she probably uses Croylon as foundation, which I do have Ben Nye, which is kind of the equivalent of it, but it's not the exact same. So I think I'm going to use more everyday makeup and try to get it as close as possible. But without further ado, I know Trixie's ass ain't got no stubble, so one moment, I will be right back without this. Boom, bitch, we are back. Oh my god, I look so much younger. Anyways, let's jump into this. I am going to switch this out a little later for a wig cap, but I'm gonna keep it on now, and ooh, it looks like he's already getting into eyebrows. Fortunately, I have a six-pack of glue sticks just to cover these Bushman eyebrows. All right, and he's just rubbing this shit in there. Ooh, he's combing them back with a teasing brush. I don't fucking even own a teasing brush. Okay, just going off what I've done in the past, I'm actually gonna use the flat end of these tweezers. Who the fuck uses a teasing comb? And he really packs this shit on here, so let's just go balls to the wall with it, I guess. My God, it's not even dry, and he's applying foundation shit that makes me so nervous. Let me just apply one or two more layers of this. My god, this smells like toe cheese. Okay, so now he's applying foundation with the eyebrows still wet and I said I was gonna use more everyday makeup but I think I'm actually gonna go in with this Ben Nye in the shade Ultra Beige. My god Trixie, you're moving too fucking fast. I gotta pause you. Just apply this down there. Holy shit, that's light. I haven't used this in so long. I got it for a theater class. Oh my god, maybe I should switch to a darker shade. Shit. Alright, let's go down to the shade Natural Beige. Oh shit. Shit, yes, that is so much better. My god, this is gonna be the best shade matching we've ever had on this channel. And that brush is leaving big ass brush strokes, so I'm actually gonna bounce it in with a booty blender. Oh my, that is very, very light concealer. And I actually think I'm gonna go in with two concealers. One is this Kat Von D Locket Concealer, and then just to brighten things up, I'm gonna go over that with this Amazing Cosmetics Concealer. So let's put some of that on right there. Oh shit, he hasn't done the forehead yet. Fuck me. We'll bounce that in. And that did conceal very well, but it didn't really highlight Jack's shit, so let's try this shade instead. Ooh, yeah, that might be better. Also might not be. Oh my god, I'm using so much product, I can literally feel it on my face. Okay, so now he's using cream contour, and I do have something similar in Ben Nye, but I'm actually going to use Anastasia, because for me, this actually goes on a little bit better. Oh, please, that right down there. And to me, this actually doesn't seem dark enough, so I'm gonna take this darker shade right here. Here. Let's try that instead. Oh, fuck yes, honey. There we go. Okay, and we'll bring this up a little bit because we do have kind of a different face shape, so I'm trying to round this out a little bit more. Oh, shit. Now we have to do the cheekbone. Oh, this part scares me. Okay, so right about there. Uh. Oh shit. Oh, oh jeez. Oh my god, that is so far out. Trixie's kind of goes like a triangle. Oh Jesus. Makes it look so easy. Okay, so we take a little bit more of that flesh tone. Oops, that's not a fucking mirror. We take a little bit more of that flesh tone and clean the edge up. Oh, oh, that got rid of that edge marvelously. If only I could get rid of toxic people that easily. I also want to note that I am doing this with no sound, so yay for me. Oh, shit. Now I have to get this even somehow. Okay, that's not that bad. It's a good start. Oh, shit. It started off so good. Now it's all fucked up. I'll go in and clean this edge up. Okay, then we go on the corners with a darker shade. Oh, that looks so banging. See this line right there? That is the straightest part about me. Oh, God, he's moving on to the other part parts of his body. Contour the forehead. Oh my god, that's so dark. Is that right? That can't be right. Oh my god, girl. Why you so orange, girl? <gasps> Did he just lick his glue stick? Do I have to do that? Oh, that actually doesn't taste that bad. Now I see what the hype is about eating these. Oh, it's kind of like creamy but sweet at the same time. Mmm. Ooh. And then we have some light powder of some sort. Oh shit, is that a powder foundation? 
Ooh, ow, my eyebrows. Oh, Kern, he's pretty much just setting the highlights. Oh, just like that. Is that gonna somehow magically make it look better? I myself have actually done this where you kind of erase the edges with translucent powder. And it's interesting because so many makeup tricks that the beauty gurus use these days came from drag queens. Oh my God, his looks so much prettier than mine. Oh damn, daddy's already moving on to the next contour. So let's dip into this Kat Von D. I actually have not even used this yet. So I'm not even sure how pigmented it is. Okay, and it looks like he's setting this contour with it. Oh shit, I forgot to recontour my cheeks. I need paper. Okay, so he holds his kind of like that. Where the fuck did my contour brush just go? Okay, let's try this. And... Oh, it's perfect line! Oh my god, that is amazing. Shit, I have no mirror on this side. I have to like eyeball it. <gasps> Ah, beautiful! I'm actually gonna dip back into the shade and light palette by Kat Von D and set underneath my eyes even more with it. All right, so we have one more go around on the eyebrows. And then while they're still wet, apparently, we're gonna set them with some powder. Ugh. Ooh, oh my god. That actually works. Oh, damn. <sighs> oh, damn. Just gonna dip right into this bitch. Oh, <gasps> that looks so fucking good. If I ever become a drag queen, I am gonna do the shit out of this method. And then he takes his powder puff and, uh, wait a fucking second. He has blush on. When did I forget blush? She has like this bright ass neon blush. So let's go ahead back with this shit. And, oh my God, that is hella bright. Wow. <laughs> God, I love it. Also, I do want to say that I keep saying him and I keep saying that because Trixie isn't Trixie yet. It's still Brian. Okay, so we are moving on to eyes. Oh my God, this scares me the most. I'm going to take a cream liner. I always like to squirt the inside with a little bit of setting spray just to moisten it up a bit. All right, and he's going directly up. Oh my God, this scares me. Directly up. Oh geez. Okay. Like right there. <gasps> oh my God. Wait, maybe that was a little bit too high. Oh God, he meets it right down here at the corner of the eye. Oh Jesus, this is gonna be in my fucking hairline. Okay, that's not that bad. It could be much worse. Just kind of bringing the end right about here. Holy shit, this is so stressful. I'm like sweating. Okay, so that's probably about as good as we're gonna get that side. Oh my god, I don't even know where to start for the other side to make this even. This is why I never fucking do eyebrows because I just have no concept of how to mirror things evenly. Okay, so he's taking a little bit more of that and he's going out just like that. Shit, one is lower than the other. Like that? This is so fucking uneven. Oh, car bitch, now what you do? Oh, you taking it and smoking it out with a brush, okay. Oh, fuck me, mine's dried. Am I supposed to use an eyeshadow? Okay, like that. What the fuck is on my nose? Not gonna lie, this is actually kind of fun once you get past the initial fear of it all. Sounds like anal. Okay, for eyebrows, I can't tell if he's using a dry or wet product, but I'm assuming that it's wet. So I'm gonna take some yellow shadow and spray it with some setting spray. Oh my God, my eyebrows are gonna be way too fucking Hi. I really can't even see the yellow that I just laid down. I see it on camera, but not in person. So we're just gonna wing this shit. Then it looks like he takes a little darker shade. Oh my god, this is not working. I think we might actually have to go in with a real brow product here. This is so fucking bad. Fuck my life. Let's clean these bitches up with a little bit of foundation. And we'll start with the white down here. For this part, I am using some Ben Nye cream paint. Oh, fuck me. I forgot to contour my nose. Oh, shit shit on a stick. Oh my god, I can't believe I forgot to do that. And then it looks kind of like he's setting all the white with a white powder, so I'm gonna go in with this Makeup Peak white shadow and just set that. It looks like he's taking some more black, and we're gonna take it right down here on the lower lash. Oh, that's sexy. Holy shit, did I really draw this eyebrow like half an inch shorter than this one? Damn it, I need to fix that. And then the glitter part, we're actually gonna have to skip because I'm just realizing my big box of glitter I brought to my mom's an hour away, so I I don't have them. But we do have lipstick and I believe in the video he actually uses Jeffree Star. I'm not sure if it's the same shade, but this is the shade Ice Cream, which unfortunately I only have in bullet style, but we're still gonna try it.
Holy shit, I annihilated the fuck out of that lipstick. And then there is a little bit of a lighter shade in the middle, which I only have in a liquid form, so we're just gonna try that. It looks like he's using a shit ton of lashes layered on top of each other, but I have these 301... What the fuck? Why do I have two left lashes? Where the fuck is the right one? Well, it's not gonna be as good as these, but I guess we'll have to glue a bunch together. Oh my god, you can hardly even fucking see them. Well, I'm not gonna lie, that's disappointing as fuck. Maybe we'll have a little better luck with these lower lashes. I think the only thing left is a wig, so I will be right back. This is so funny. I have like the contour of Trixie, the hair of Kesha, and the lips of somebody who just blew a big ass dick. I kind of love it. I do I wish the hair though had a little bit more volume like Trixie's, but this'll do. I am actually really fucking happy with this. I have such a huge appreciation for drag queens. This took me five fucking hours to do. I could not imagine doing this every fucking day, like super huge props. I think it's so fucking cool that Trixie created such a unique character that you instantly see these eyes in this jawbone contour and you know it came from her. This was so much fun to do. I need to go tame this wig because it is looking nasty and ratty as fuck. But even though this look is not perfect at all, I mean the contour is all jacked up and the eyes are kind of weird, I still had so much fucking fun creating this. And now that I have long hair, I totally understand why the Kardashians are always playing with it on Keeping Up With The Kardashians. So fun, I feel like Beyonce. But there we go, let's do one Trixie model pose. And we are out of here. Like always, please be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell down below so that you're notified anytime I upload a new video. Don't forget my newest collection of highlighters, including Black Ice, which does change from black to white, is available at thepoplex.com. Also, my latest album, Kiss of Fame, is available everywhere online that music is sold. Thank you so much to everyone who's supporting them. Comment down below, let me know what you thought of this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. You can follow me on Snapchat, Instagram, and Twitter at OfficialNady, and you can follow me online at thepoplex.com. Thank you so much for watching. I love you all, and I will see you again soon. Bye. Yeah.